Hey everybody, I'm here with another unboxing. Uh, the box got kind of late, so the best lit room in the house, I think it's here, the kitchen, so just bear with me. So I got here this box from Amazon. Um, this you actually uh, I got from a giveaway on Instagram. It's very nice. So it's an East Rock soprano size ukulele and uh, they come with a kit they seem to be one of those uh, kits very affordable um, on Amazon there are many choices so um, I'm curious to see if this will be a viable uh, option for a beginner that have to go on Amazon and they have so many options so if this one will be a good starter so this is the box it's with one small smaller box inside the box seems a sturdy box this is like from East Rock and it comes with some accessories Uh, comes with a strap. Ooh, I dropped it. So picks. Uh, those picks actually, I don't like them very much. Some companies do put those picks um, with the ukuleles, but they are actually not that great because they can scratch the instrument, and uh, they're not very good for those kind of strings, the nylons. So it will be better uh, felt picks. I think that even tutorials online about how you can't even make them at home and all. And they will be better than those. So there's some picks that I dropped, most of them. Uh, a tuner. And it does seem to come with a uh, battery, which is definitely a plus because a lot of those instruments do not. Uh, there's a little cloth. Um, and carbon strings, which I thought was very interesting because it seems that the ukulele comes uh, string with the acrylics. So uh, to have a different option in terms of tone, I think it's very interesting that you can go from an acrylic to a carbon string. So that's, that's a good idea. There's this strap that I particularly not crazy about it. It's the one that has like a little hook. Um, I feel that those can stretch the instrument. Um, it's very nice that they customized and put their name on it. East Rock and all, but um, I particularly don't like it because the instrument kind of just hangs. And uh, I think there's also uh, run the risk that you can scratch your instrument. So I don't think it's uh, that great. A oh, very, I gotta say, it's very cute bag. You guys can see it's like now we have a backpack. Unfortunately, it doesn't have the hook. I do kind of have the hook so you can hang. Personally, my ukuleles I kind of got a setup that I'm hanging the instrument so to have the little loop here I think would be cool. But I mean, just this it's definitely very nice to carry to places. Not the um, how can I say the strongest padded bag I've ever seen, but I have to say, uh. This one is pretty good. It has a nice pocket. I mean, uh, let's see if the zipper. Oh, there you go. The zipper was a little. So it's a nice size pocket, so you can put it, uh, your extras, your tuner, or if you're on a trip or something, you can just like throw your, I don't know, documents, wallet there. I think would fit just fine. And this is the soprano. Not curious to know how it is. Hey everyone, um, sorry for this going to be a little bit different between uh, the real unboxing and this part here. Um, I had a problem with storage on my phone. I mean, I guess a lot of people can relate to it. And um, yeah, so sorry about that. Uh, I'm just going to finish here to give a first glance on the instrument. And then uh, I should have a, a review pretty soon. Hopefully when the strings are 
a little bit more stretched and uh, you guys can actually hear uh, how the instrument is gonna sound long term for you. So as a first impression, I have to say this instrument is impressive. <laughs> I mean, as a first instrument goes, of course, we're talking here about an entry level. We are not talking about uh, a name brand with solid tops or anything like that. So as an entry level, laminate instrument i have to say this is uh, quite impressive i think the best part of it is um the craftsmanship i mean i i mean in a quick inspection i don't really see any uh big flaws in finish uh very smooth even looking inside it seems that the job was done very clean so uh i was quite impressed and my favorite feature is the action i mean I, it's always kind of hard to see the action on those instruments uh on video i have to buy one of those rulers but uh i gotta say this is quite uh amazing for such a low price instrument to have such like a very playable I mean, you can play totally up the neck with no problems at all, no struggle. I had uh, my first instrument had a super high, uh, high action. I had to shave the saddle. It was even a fairly name brand. My husband gave me a Lanikai uh, as my first uh, ukulele, and the action was crazy high and very challenging for a beginner to start. Uh, trying to do chords and uh, as we keep learning on especially bar chords up the neck with such a high action so this is I mean for as far as beginners go this would be a breeze for them to learn on um, so all laminate mahogany uh, it seems to have a solid rosewood and the fretboard does seem very good to play I mean it's uh, very smooth no sharp frets that's uh, something too that uh, was pretty amazing uh it comes with the tuner and the tuner is working fine uh as it seems the intonation was a little bit off on the g string but uh i'll post it uh like a, i'll let you know how it goes when the strings actually stretch and i have a better idea of it but so far this is uh, i'm impressed it's a uh, very like I said, very smooth. Uh, this is a first instrument. It's uh, definitely good. Or if you don't like those options of travel instruments, uh, such as uh, plastic of other materials, like just buy this. It's cheap. You you throw, you know, to take with you to places. The gig bag, it's pretty decent. It does come with a, a strap button. Doesn't have the one here. Would be like the option that you have to tie probably around uh, the headstock. But yeah this is this is great so just a quick strumming um i'll do a better in-depth uh review of this and all the how the instrument has been doing after a few days or week or so so this is it Let's see, on the review, I also uh, make a comparison in terms of uh, sound sample between the acrylic strings and the carbon fiber. Very interesting that they gave you the option uh, to play with the tone of the instrument. So uh, that will be interesting to see. So have a great day, everybody. I appreciate your views and hopefully we can interact more and I would love to see your comments about it. Have a great day.